Like, regardless what age you are, you make bad decisions, but I mean, I wouldn't call the whole entire population stupid, you know? Um, I'm not surprised. Um, it seemed like she was joking. I don't know. So you're saying you, you would vote for someone who thinks basically you as a young person is stupid? Well, when you say it like that, it sounds like, I mean... What's up, YouTube? Hope you guys are feeling cool. Today, guys, we're back here on the new video. Today, we're going to check it out. Students hate Kamala Harris quotes when they think it's Trump. Okay? Let's check this video out together. Hi, I'm Eduardo Nuret with Campus Reform. Old comments by Kamala Harris have resurfaced where she referred to 18 to 24 year olds as stupid. So we're here today talking to young Americans to see what they think about that. Would they vote for or support someone who thinks they're stupid? Let's find out. Let's right, find so out. Would you guys vote for a politician who thinks young people are stupid? So I want to read you the quote. What else do we know about this population 18 through 24? They are stupid. Would you vote for someone who said that? No, I wouldn't because I believe young people are the future, obviously. No, honestly, no. Why? Because no matter what age, you're allowed to have your own opinion, like even 18 year olds. No, I mean, I guess like if you're speaking upon your people, the, like that's who you're representing. Like those are the types of people that like you're that are going to be voting for you. So why would you talk down upon them? How about you? Would you vote for someone who thinks young people are stupid? I personally would not. I feel like the younger people are actually a lot more educated than the older people in America. No, I would not vote for someone like that. Talking about us being stupid means that he's, he doesn't respect us and who we are. Which politician do you think said that? It's a major politician in the U.S., one that a lot of people would recognize. Who do you think said that young people are stupid? I'd have, to go, go, I'd have to go for Trump or Pence. Yeah. Probably Donald Trump. Sounds like something the president would say. I feel like it'd be like Trump. Why, why do you say Trump? What makes you think Trump would say that? Um, he's very ignorant. He's very just not mentally there and that just sounds like something he would definitely say. Because he says a lot of stupid stuff all the time. I mean, I'm sure he would say something like that. But what would you say if I told you that the person who actually said this is Joe Biden's vice presidential candidate, Kamala Harris, who he announced the other day? What would you say if I told you that? What else do we know about this population, 18 through 24? They are stupid. <laughs> that is why we put them in dormitories. And they have a resident assistant. They make really bad decisions. It doesn't surprise me. It, I, I would expect someone from the left to say something like that. Not surprised at all. A little bit surprised, not entirely though, because I have seen a lot of not so good things about her um, in regards to like uh, imprisonment of people and stuff like that. People say stuff all the time, so like, regardless of what age you are, you make bad decisions, but I mean, I wouldn't call the whole entire population stupid, you know? Um, I'm not surprised. Um, it seemed like she was joking. I don't know. So you're saying you, you would vote for someone who thinks basically you as a young person is stupid? Well, when you say it like that, it sounds like, I mean... How does that make you feel to hear her say that? To, you know, start out calling just calling us stupid. It just seems like she was trying to like get at a different population group by putting this population group down, I guess. With comments like that, knowing that and watching that now, is that going to change the way you think about who you're going to vote for? Does it change the way you view Biden and Kamala Harris? My opinion doesn't change. I've always been Bernie 2020. She doesn't have a history of being very, like, democratic. Her stances on things aren't the most accepting of everybody and they lean more conservative what what stance to you comes out to mind that you say leans more conservative for starters she is a big like fan of the police force which is what most like democrats are trying to defund and she's like a big advocate for cops and everything so yeah that just gives me more reason not to vote for them not so much because the other president why would i want mike pence as the vice president even if that's like an insult to me, like fuck that. I'm not a strong Biden supporter. I don't know whether I would vote for him this election or not. Does this affect the way you view them as a ticket? I mean, it does, but like I said, there's no way I'm voting for Trump, so it's just like. I mean, I don't agree with like young people are stupid, but like, I don't know, some are. Like, we're not exactly, like we've been eating like Tide Pods and stuff. Like I don't really think like we're smart. I think Kamala was, was actually right for once. She's actually right for calling 18 to 24 years old stupid. Because after calling them stupid, they saw the video before the election 
and they still went ahead and voted for her. So right now, I feel like we should raise the voting age to 30 because after seeing such videos, each and every one of them still accepts to vote for her. So tell me, are they smart or are they stupid? Every young people are stupid because right now you can't own a home. Now in America as a young person, it's literally very hard to own a home as a, as a young generation right now because they have actually made the system tough and hard for people. Lower wages. Everything is terrible right now in America. I'm sure they, each and every one of them right now are actually regretting their action for not actually voting for Donald Trump in the first place. And the following thing is that these 18 to 24 years are our future leaders. They, they actually said this in the video, but still went ahead to vote for the same woman that called them stupid. You see how crazy that looks? Proving Kamala Harris right. Comment down below what you think about this video. Give us a thumbs up, share this video as many as you can subscribe to our channel. I'll see you guys in the next video. Make sure you stay safe.